thousands work to make ends meet, economists say consumer confidence is falling back to where it was when the pandemic first struck. Levi Ismail is speaking to experts who say fewer people feel confident to spend and it could have long term impacts. There's a lot of uncertainty about where jobs will be and how families will manage during this recession. But we're talking with one economist who tells us that this pandemic is just one part of what will put this economy to the test. One of the best ways we gauge consumer confidence is by seeing for ourselves. Are people still visiting? Are they still spending? Or is it more about just hanging on? Right now we're making it. I mean, we, we try not to waste a lot of money. You know? As of yesterday, Brandon Holt now has a very good reason to keep an eye on just how much he spends. And we really didn't calculate all the, the expenses as a ba having a baby and everything because, I mean, we didn't expect any of this to happen as well. Like so many others, Brandon and his wife are out of a job. The pandemic made sure of that. Unemployment only covers so much. We'll see effects, actually, I think, for many years to come. Seventy percent of our income relies on consumer spending, but Professor Andy Borchers of Lipscomb University says right now, half of all consumers believe their family's income will drop. It's so widespread. It's not just a part of the country or a certain sector of the economy. The path to recovery, Borchers says, starts with local business. Extra safety measures like making masks mandatory could help employees feel safer and bring them back sooner. The same could be said about customers. I think what we need to look at in the economy will be structural changes over time. For how fast it was to see our economy stumble, Borchers says we could recover just as fast. Some industries, like travel, may take time, but if we can make people feel safe, our future has a chance. Levi Ismail, News Channel 5. While our unemployment numbers are improving in Tennessee, it is not a fast process. Wallet Hub found compared to the rest of the country, the volunteer state is bouncing back 10th slowest. 